going on guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking about to be down here on this Saturday evening. It's 8.46 p.m. We've been going all day doing Halloween activity type stuff with the grandkids and uh, one of my one of my sons and uh, we've been going all day and we are worn out. Uh, we not only did the Halloween activity stuff but we also went and spent a lot of time in Lowe's because the uh, horrible customer service couldn't get no help for nothing. So we were there for like an hour longer than we should have been. And then we unloaded all that stuff at the house and went back out and went to Walmart and we were there and spent a lot of money. We got a Halloween party coming up plus the Halloween itself. Uh, we get a lot of trick-or-treaters here. So uh, yeah, we had, a, we had a lot of stuff to go buy and get ready for our our party and Halloween night and all that kind of stuff so we've been running around all day so having said all that let's do an unboxing guys you know that I collect Masters of the Universe the Masterverse line of Masters of the Universe and not only does it uh, have the revolution revelation animated series from Netflix, which is where it all started from with the figures, but they've kind of branched out and they do other kind of sublines and different things under the Masterverse name, like the new Eternia line. They have some figures from the 87 Masters of the Universe movie that was horrible, but I got the figures because I've never had those, so they're kind of cool anyway. So they have like all these different sublines and different stuff under the Masterverse label. So uh, let's take a look at what we got here today. This one here I'm really excited about because as a kid I never had this figure. So I'm pretty pretty happy about it and it's not and the thing is it's not even just a regular figure it's a deluxe figure so that's pretty cool too so we have a box a box within a box and I bet there's another box within this box so let's take a look and uh, this, this was available on Mattel's website Tuesday. Uh, they, do these, they do these big releases sometimes for certain figures. And uh, sometimes you never know if they're going to last for five minutes or for five years. So it's one of those things that you kind of want to get in on like instantly. So you're sitting there waiting for the clock to start and boom, and you're on it. So that's what this figure is. It's one of those I had to kind of do that with, but uh, it's worth it. It, it kind of makes things fun, a little interesting to, to get in there and get this done. So stay, don't fall. And uh, as you can tell, it is the new Eternia um, Horde Trooper, new Eternia Horde Trooper. The box is pretty nice. It's a deluxe figure. It's a lot, it's a good eight inches tall. So, uh, and uh, I am a box collector. I typically don't open up any of my figures, but these uh, I do open up because I mean you can't see them. Like these over here, they got windows in the in the box, so you can see them. But these here, they don't. You got to kind of open them up. So. I don't like doing that, but it's part of the game. So you open it up, and you got Hordak right here, picture of him, and uh, this right here comes off. And it's kind of a little backdrop where you can put him in front of it and do some, you know, just have him in front of a little backdrop kind of thing. <gasps> so. Here he is, the Horde Trooper. That's a good figure right there. That's pretty cool. 
And uh, I don't know if I can take his helmet off. Yep, his helmet came off. Okay, and then it's got the little little troll looking thing under, under there. So, I'm not sure who that is, if that's supposed to be, you know, a horde trooper kind of in uh, some certain form, or if that's horde act in some certain form, or, or horde prime in some certain form. I don't know what that is, but, you know, there's some questions, and I think some people know, but uh, I've kind of forgotten. But anyway, he's got a big sword. He's got a staff, all that good stuff. I'm sorry, it is a little dark in here, but still, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's a big figure. And I wouldn't doubt that he has some stuff in this box. Most of the time they do. Oh, I can take it out, so we'll see. Sometimes they have stuff in here, but he might not because he's kind of limited on what he's got anyway. No, he's got something in there. I don't know what it is. Oh, I know what it is. I think it's something that goes on top of his helmet. Or something. No, I don't know what it is. It ain't that. That ain't what it is. I don't know what it is. What are you doing? What? Did you see I'm making a video. What are you doing? Ew. Wait, you're in the video. Here, back up. Over here. There you go. <laughs> Hold on. See, look. Look. Hey. The horde. He's called a horde trooper. A horde trooper. Anyway, guys, that's my new horde trooper. So. Anyhow, if you're interested in that kind of stuff, let me know in the comments. And uh, if you're not interested in that stuff, well, don't let me know in the comments. So, anyway. Try to pop it. Well, careful, you're going to trip on a cord. Huh, well, where are you going? You want me to pop it? That was loud. All right, let me let me end the video here. Give me a minute. All right, guys, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beat down. That's me, Michael, your incredible host with an incredible granddaughter, number one, and the, uh, number two's up in the up there somewhere. I don't know where she's at. She's playing get up. Game. Okay, get up, get out, get red. Do it, tune. We'll see you next time on the body beat down. Can you tell them bye? Bye. Yeah, bye. See y'all later. Bye. Get up, get out, get around and do it, do it!